Nuggies, welcome to this video. I am Noxy, and you are in the ultimate zone for truth, enlightenment, and entertainment. Tuh. Today, we are wearing our beautiful orange dress from Boohoo. Let's ignore the mess. I was hiding, and see how it's so perfectly out of frame? Genius. Because I spilled water on myself. So, that's also your call to drink water. Drink water. Clear. Are those bubbles? My dress is completely soaked now. Okay. So, we're going to be doing my whole sunglass collection today. Because I have quite a few. That's them in these crates, these boxes, whatever you call this. It's probably not the nicest way to put away my sunglasses, but it's what I've done over the years. Because a lot of my sunglasses are secondhand. Um they're like vintage or that doesn't explain mistreating them but they're not being mistreated for fuck's sake fuck sorry for cursing so i just want to explain a bit fuck my history with sunglasses i love them i've been wearing them since i was very small since i was a little girl and um i rarely go out without sunglasses i kind of always have them on me because I don't like for people to make eye contact with me everywhere I go. I'm uh, a super empath and I just don't have time for most people. And also, sun damage to your eyes is a real thing that everybody should be thinking about and trying to prevent. So, speaking of sun damage, this fucking light is killing me. Get the fuck out. Can you just do... That's actually not bad. It's a bit darker, huh? But it's just like, if she could light me up without burning my retina. Because I'm trying to smuggle bricks from China in my thick vagina. Okay, so I actually had this whole fucking playlist with like, um, making the Stallions and Nicki Man Manages. But Nicki Manages and Megan the Stallions are not up at this time. For it is truly, wait, I will tell you it is 12 43 eh? yes that is a photograph of me on my telephone do you know why eh? do you notice i am wearing orange like in these moments because i have a lot of sacral chakra healing to do eh? i was called names my whole childhood since i was eight years old somebody called me a bitch -o. so i do not really believe in myself eh? i am here to inspire you as much as i inspire myself because for real reals i don't want to be doing none of this nonsense <laughs> let's do this video so these were my first glasses they were my glasses when i was a little kid when i was like a baby um, they still kind of fit my face and uh, I did give birth to a baby and um, he has worn these on occasion so that's just so heartwarming also today my objective is to count how many glasses I have and let's keep in <coughs> mind that these are sorry not all the sunglasses I've ever owned in my life I have owned so many pairs that have broken that I've had to throw out and some are broken and I've kept them because I have a bit of a hoarder thing to me I don't know my south node is in Pisces and I'm a bit of a hoarder now this is the second pair I love these I bought these at a uh, value village years ago although where I live it's not called that and they are just black rim sunglasses they're very good at concealing your eyes like I have so much I have so many lights on me right now and from here you guys are like is she who is she yeah so I love those ones this would be pair number let's call it number two because those first ones are not really mine so this is number two these ones we got from a from an antique shop and uh they cost me five dollars i couldn't believe that the people were selling them for five dollars i love the tint on them they are very scratched like no matter how much i clean them they'll still be scratched they're very old they're like from the 70s or 80s i live for this right here it's like just these two metal squares but they make they look like diamonds when you're wearing it like these glasses are very nice 
These are fucking fancy. So, number two. Number three are my If I Was a Rich Girl. La 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 la. I wouldn't hire Asian people as tokens because I'm not racist. So, these are Louis Vuitton glasses. Louis Vuitton glasses. Let me explain this. Let me explain this. Let me explain this. I come from like... I'm realizing a pretty materialistic family. Everybody likes to have like nice jewelry. Everybody likes to have like bags. Um, growing up, my mother, even though we really did not have money, she uh, would get really nice things for us. And then when we got into a certain age, my sibling and I, she started to buy name brand things. And it was just like a lot of Louis Vuitton and Tiffany and uh, Michael Kors is coming into the house and um, one of the last gifts my mom gave to me before I stopped speaking to her and during the pandemic was a Karl Lagerfeld bag that's right beside me here and um, it's just weird because we didn't really have money so what's this obsession with having expensive things if you don't actually have money it's just weird to me but these glasses cost six hundred dollars for a real at Louis Vuitton and we were there because we were doing something for my parent and um I saw these let me explain I saw these and I fell in fucking love like they are such perfect Se look at this look 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 Frucha and yo I'm sorry but they're sparkly like the rim is sparkly <gasps> you guys can see it oh my god oh my god it says Louis Vuitton here in the top corner it also says it in many places like all around so I spotted these oh my god in store when I was maybe 17 or 18 and I was really just trying to think like how much would I have to work to pay for them now I was getting paid like ten dollars an hour or maybe nine or eleven max at the time and these were six hundred dollars before tax meaning probably closer to eight hundred and my parents so my mother went online and searched for months for like the boot-like version but they're literally such perfect replicas um these glasses I, I i was crying in store i fall in love with fashion i fall in love with bags i fall in love with shoes uh, and cars all the time i'm not materialistic anymore but i do appreciate certain things and i really appreciate beautiful design so i'm at the basis I'm an artist um, she was able to find this case also online and yo it comes with like the case and the cloth and it's just honestly these were an amazing replica so you know it's the kind of shit you guys are gonna hear me rag on my mom they are a covert narcissist. That person is a covert narcissist. Um, they were physically, spiritually, verbally, psychologically, emotionally abusive towards me. But then they would do shit like this. Just go and hunt down the perfect gift, you know? The next pair. These probably came from Dull's Kill. They're so dirty. Uh oh, oh my god, I almost poked my own eye out. But they're just a sparkly, very 60s rim. I love them. I really love these glasses. I do not wear them much. They do give a little bit Willy Wonka. They're giving a bit of Willy Wonka. Okay? Do you agree? But sparkles all over. And I personally don't shop from Doll's Kill anymore. I have bought many amazing things from Doll's Kill including these shoes that I wear in one of my latest reels on Instagram. I actually twisted my ankle filming the shot 
after the shot that I knew I was going to use. I was like, oh, let's just do one for safety. It's the film, it's the videographer in me. I was like, one for safety. But then it was like such a dumb idea because honestly, I just fucking fucked up my ankle. Um, so send prayers. And next. <gasps> I fucking love these ones. So these ones, I think, are also from Doll's Kill from years ago. Like, I've had these for so long. Are they dirty? Let's clean them. Oh my god, I have to shit. Look how pretty. Look, I just love... Okay, guys, guys. This is a very 50s, 60s cut. They are reflective as fuck, so you, like, can't see my eyes. You can't see my eyes my eyes and they're see-through all over and they have stood AJ Morgan I'm seeing in here they have stood the test of motherfucking time because I have had these glasses for three four years now next okay the next pair is fighting me guys ugh. okay talking about this yesterday with my husband the fact that once in film class there were these people who did a really awful video project and they had this exaggerated scene in the beginning of somebody just throwing all their clothes out of their closet onto the floor so they could pick an outfit and I don't know if you guys know who internet girl is online on Instagram let's say but and that bitch was in my class and um i remember everybody was like yeah we all do that we all throw our clothes to pick our outfits and she and i looked at each other and we were like we don't do that <laughs> because like i don't do that with clothes but i will do that with sunglasses also great i just bled onto my chair so just give me five seconds to figure something out. Oh, fuck me. I kicked over my water. This is low budget production, guys. There's there's actually no there's oh fuck. There's no there's no budget for production today. There's just Oh my god. Oh wait. <gasps> guys, I'm wiping it and it's actually going away. I've never seen blood leave like this. Are you serious right now? That's like blessed pussy blood. Yeah, for real. Okay, that's blessed pussy blood. So I'm just gonna... It's just that... Whatever. Oh my god. So you guys saw two sunglasses just now. You saw these in red. And you saw them now in this almost turtoy shell thing. These are gigantic sunglasses. We bought two for 25 at Delilah. Some store like in the metro. And aren't they ultimate butterfly sunglasses? Like when I wear these, there's always somebody who's like, what the fuck? I'm realizing that they really make me look like an alien. I'm surprised people are like, wow, I just look like an alien. So, which ones do you guys prefer? Let me know down in the comments. Um, fuck! It's these vintage ones that fell. They bit the dust. Yes! Now, the next pair also both come from the same company. And if you've watched my Boohoo haul, where I review clothing in sizes 10, uh, 8 to 12, you will have seen these. They're dirty. Very dirty. But these ones... I love them. And these ones. Again, with that tortoise shell kind of print. Oh, these are so cute with this dress. I'm on vacation. But you can't come. I'm busy enough. Call me next month. Day. Um, don't fall backwards. Girl. Baby girl. I said, baby girl. Yo, I need to run to the bathroom. I'll be right back. Why did I think it was an option? What is it like to the one who never answers their calls? Why? 
Can we all give shout out props to my husband who lets me make all this noise while he's sleeping, never complains, doesn't even really wake up while it's happening. I, okay, I, I did something like quick. I'm just trying to hide the wetness of the dress. Okay, 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 give me a second. Give me one second, I'm busy. Don't kill me. I'm busy. I'm so busy. Okay. Okay. Fuck me. Okay. Ah, oh, sir. So, we're not even counting the glasses. What a big fail. So, so far, we are at we are at one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Eight and nine. This is the collection. <laughs> and if you want to count my baby glasses, ten, bitch. Okay. I want to also mention that I have these because safety first. Did you hear my stomach go crazy? So, I don't know. Sorry, I got lost for a second of myself there. So, I don't know what these are. But there's, they're cute, okay? They're safety glasses, and I will wear them when needed. I will be safe. I hope you're being safe. Then, these ones. Oh, my God. These poor baby girls. Baby girl. Uh-huh. She's so scratched. Like, these glasses have been through school with me. They went to college with me. They've been with me for over 10 years. I don't wear them anymore. I'd be a little bit embarrassed to wear these now but just because this is just not in fashion, I find, anymore. Uh, just these kind of sunglasses. But when I did buy them, they were. There's also a strong chance I stole them. And I'm coming out here and seeing the truth. I shoplifted a lot as a young person. I shoplifted so much and I don't anymore. Because when you shoplift, you're telling the universe that you don't inherently believe that you'll ever be able to really own those items. Therefore, you're telling the universe, I think I'm poor and you'll stay poor. So don't steal. These ones broke. But this is an example of glasses that I couldn't bring myself to get rid of because look at them. Look, when they existed, how nice they were. <laughs> is <laughs> Probably time to throw them out. But to replace them and my broken heart about them, I bought these. This is actually what I'm wearing in my profile picture, but something's wrong with them. They're a little bit higher on one side than the other. You can see that. It really bothers me every time. Plus, they're made of plastic, so how am I going to change that? So I just kind of lift them on one side and then, you know. You see? Some cheating. Cheating. I'm a cheating dog. You got to do what you need to do for it to look good here, but then that looks so... I love these glasses, but they did not stand the test of time, and these probably also came from... If they're not from Dollskill, they're from ASOS.
these are some little very simple Arden glasses that I bought years ago. Again, I don't wear these anymore. Very big when I was 18. The teal, the turquoise was very, the mint was super big. Um, I love that they have a turquoise shell, but I really wore these probably four times to school max. They were not really my glasses. Uh -huh. We've got some other protective glasses, but I fucking love these glasses. They do not protect from the sun for shit. No sun protection in these. But... Did you hear my stomach? And that's really like the main thing you want to look for is sun protection. If your glasses... <gasps> oh my god. There's like some of my hair in the glasses. And the hair is so pretty. And it's so healthy. <gasps> Oh my god. I'm just gonna like... I feel like somebody who has my hair... <coughs> my mom is doing witchcraft with it or something. So, I, like, I don't know. I just want to say, don't do witchcraft on people. Don't manifest people coming back. Don't manifest people loving you. Just don't do it. Don't do it. Like, get a real job. Get a real job. And don't harass any person on the planet. Ever. Okay, come back, 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 back up, reverse, okay, oh, I forgot to keep counting again, okay, this is long, next is these ones, these are biking glasses, this is what I would wear if I go biking, there's nothing else to say about them, very comfortable, they're bendable, like, even in the lens part, there's some give. Yeah. Next! Are these ones? These are so cute. These are some of my favorite glasses. They're very opaque, so they will really, really protect me from the sun. But they also, if I wear them on a day where there isn't much sun, can't see shit. Very thin rim, and look, it barely reaches my ear. But where I got these is actually a flea market. Yeah, I got these from a flea market. Oh my god, I had gotten these from a flea market too, and my kid broke them. Look how cute they were, but they make everything red. Be me for a minute. Can you drive in these? The answer is no. 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 No, you can't because it changes like all the light colors. It's just not safe to wear. Yeah, I guess while I'm talking about that, I'll just try on my next red pair. So this comes from um, somebody, but somebody gave it to them. Yeah, and then they gave it to me and I was like, oh, they're cute. I've never worn them because they're red, but they're big. Um, if I play a role that requires these, I will, but I, so far I've only been called to wear them once, a very long time ago. And last but not least, from the top box is these ones. Oh my god, I love them. The, if this doesn't scream a matrix up your ass, I don't know what the fuck will. Because... The brand is, there's actually a brand written, oh I thought it used to be written on them, maybe there used to be a sticker. Mod rolling, same on the other side, but it got erased. But there used to be like a name brand on these. But I don't know where. Okay, I thought there was a name brand. But they're kind of greenish inside. Look how matrixy. Look, look. And then it's got the turquoise shell thing also all around. I really love small glasses. I just love them. Just 90s, forever. Now, let's count how many were in the top and try to help me remember so that we know what we've done. So, one, two, three, four, five, six. Oh, these ones we didn't do. Seven. Eight, nine, 
10, 11, 12, oh my god, 13, 14, 15, ah, 15, and I technically showed you 17, but only 15 of them are actually operational, like they're functional, and also I'm realizing there's a pair missing. Is it in here? Oh my god. I'm honestly so good to myself. Okay, so that's the first bin. Now, the next bin. This is the brand Morgan. Now, I don't know if anybody knows this brand, but my mom had a couple of shirts from this. This was like some brand in the 80s or 90s. Apparently, a lot of hearts involved in the marketing or in the branding. Open it up. And out come these glasses. These are so funny. I took pictures in these when I dressed up as like a cat for Halloween. I wore these as my glasses. Look at them. You definitely have to be in a vibe. You definitely have to be wearing certain things. You definitely have to be like, this is the mood. But every time I put these on, it feels serious. Like, they're heavy. They're heavy. And they're really like this metal, golden. Like, they're just beautiful. They're really beautiful. Um, yeah. I inherited a lot of cute vintage things from my parent. And then some things they took back. Because they crazy. You see, you crazy. Oh, you crazy. Okay. Next. If you guys are like, what is she doing? It's none of your business. None of your business. Okay. Next. These I got given by probably my sibling just because they knew I might wear them more than they do. But I hate them because my lashes touch them when they're actually on my face. And then when I push them lower, they just look stupid. And then... They're just free glasses they got. You know, they say fucking poppers. Like, I don't even drink poppers anymore. I just can't. I never worn these. If if you want them, comment down below. Be like, I need those in my life. We'll work out a deal. I will ship them to you. Next! Oh my god, these glasses. I hate these so much. This just puts me in a bad mood. These glasses just piss me off. It's like, it's not fucking 2010 the fuck is this they also have the turquoise shell which is actually like the actual shade of turquoise shell that I want for more of my jewelry more of my glasses like look how nice that is but they're so ugly UK to LA so these came from some random shop honestly whatever if ever these come back Maybe I should give them to my husband. He wears shit like this in his car just to be like, yeah. So maybe, I don't know. I don't know. Wow. But clearly, I was having a round glasses moment. Now these babies. <laughs> Even if the metal over here digs into my skin. Oh baby, I'll still wear them. I still wear them because I look like John Lennon when I'm wearing these glasses. Do you see that shit? Let it be. Imagine a world without people beating with men. Because that's something that John Lennon did. He beat his first wife. Did you know that? Did you know that? Okay. Okay. I don't care how much you found peace and love. If you've done some fucked up shit involving abusing children or abusing a weaker person, I don't care what gender they are. You going to hell for that. You going to burn. You going to burn. Especially if you never fucking acknowledge it. And publicly, you don't wear that as like, that's my mistake. Okay? Mm. Eh? Last. 
but definitely not the least is hey eh? I'm lying because I have another pair after these ones are always tight they've always been tight going on they are Dion uh, Diane Ver Diane von Furstenberg glasses so they've got this little bear on the side I got these when I was 15 and oh they're really cute like these glasses just do no wrong <laughs> they're so cute they do no wrong <gasps> they're reminding me of a pair I used to wear when I had these two I had these big round ones oh my god now those were styling but this but they broke they broke so badly I threw them out like for for the hoarder to throw them out <laughs> you know it was broken but these ones oh that's actually so cute Gina Kapurin Arin si shoren Pung son ultako Naragago ye pum kundo kogo shi Ba ya pung soni Ham nero nam yo Ne nam rumedo Naraka go shiro kuge se gana. It's just that when I do it, I hear a sound in my head. I don't know if it's good, but I can hear my muscles going like, Arr. okay, I'm done. I'm done. So, last, but definitely not least, Princess Fiona. So they're in a guest case, but they're not guest glasses. But how cute is this case? Wow. Take a look at my girlfriends. She's the only one I got. Hmm. Not much of a girlfriends. I never seen to get a lot. Oh! Oh, 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 these glasses never let me down. They never let me down. These glasses, these glasses, these glasses, these glasses never let me down. Let's get into a yacht. So they are not guests, like I just told you. Can you guess what they are? No, I'm joking. They are BB glasses. So my... I was gifted these at like my 20 something birthday and let's just point out what's very cute although 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 wow last time I checked BB still uses like rabbit fur in their clothing not cute not a look <clears throat> not cute but let's take a look so it's got the B here it's got the B there I don't know if you guys remember but like in the 2000s BB would have so many ads in magazines and the glasses have this patterned thing here which I don't know what that's supposed to be and this is how they did it they actually patterned it on the plastic on the inside and then on the outside when you're wearing them they have these patterns that come out right in the top look at these this finger looks so big perspective bitch okay so yeah these are the bb glasses i have yeah um these were bought online as you can see by the fact that they did not come with their original case and as i said they were a gift to me by my parents i think maybe the last thing that we can try on is not sunglasses but sight glasses so my sight glasses let me explain this shit so i started a job in my early 20s and um i needed glasses and i went to this place that i found on my own and they were going to charge me eight hundred dollars for the the glasses and my mom was like what's wrong with you no no at least she wasn't mean to me she was just like no you got like no that's a scam let me find something for you queen of ebay over here <clears throat> though i will rightfully take that place one day it went online and fucking found me tiffany's glasses online with their case everything inside guys i'm gonna repeat this is all happening on ebay ebay 
eBay. Partner up with this. It will help you look less irrelevant because you are not. You are not irrelevant, eBay. I see you, eBay. You looking good, bae. You look good. You look good. So, I'm just going to try these on. So, these are my side glasses. I do need side glasses when I'm reading. Though, um, at one point, I didn't wear them for like two years. Um, I credit that to falling in love with a very high rate, vi high vibrational being who just help me overcome so many things that I didn't need them and I wear them very rarely now but these are my sight glasses they're cute right um if ever I have to go on the stand I'm definitely wearing them I'll be like yes no <laughs> So this is the end of the fucking video. Um, no, I don't need these most of the time, so I don't wear them. They kind of make my eyes bigger too, so. But I do love these glasses. Oh, let's get into the detail of them. So Tiffany's has some of the most beautiful frames. I had noticed that years ago. And as I told you, my mom used to like all these high-end stuff, so we were often in those stores, and I saw these. Uh, not these ones exactly, but when she saw them online, like, you know, with the blue, which my previous glasses were kind of blue. Though I didn't choose them, but I liked them. And then, um, with the eights on the side, that's really a vibe, right? So, and the first eight is diamond, and then it says Tiffany. And these are not bootleg, these are actual Tiffany frames that... I went and put the lenses that I needed into and that's going to be the end of the video. So I want to thank you for being here. Well, I'm seeing just a little bit like enhanced, you know, it's intense. So, um, I don't know. I'm getting a weird message. Like if some of you need to wear your glasses and you don't, please wear your fucking glasses or your vision is going to deteriorate and you're going to feel hella stupid like in your 60s. It's weird. It's really early actually, but you're going to feel really dumb when you're like 60 if you don't wear your glasses. Um, besides that, so you guys I already told you the next video coming out is more than likely going to be my wig collection and then we're going to get into some really fun creative stuff. So thank you for being here. Thank you for all the returning subscribers. Thank you to all the fucking new subscribers. I hope you enjoy this one. Let me know down below what you liked about it and let me know what you'd like to see more of on my channel if you so are inclined. If you are so inclined, if you have ideas, you know. Um, my socials are all Noxie Ultimate and I am sending love and light to you. Bye. And see you in the next one, Nuggies. Bye. Anybody wondering why I call you guys Nuggies? It's because like, it's the closest thing to like my nigga without calling you like my nigga. But also because Nuggies can be like a nugget of gold, a nugget of chicken, a nugget of weed. Just nuggets are great. So, you know, Nuggies, my nuggets, 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 Nuggies, 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 Nuggies. <clears throat> I need to go to bed. I love you. Bye.